Namaste. Welcome again to our channel, Cupid Educational Services. In this video series, we are solving the ISR Aptitude Test 2021 Physics questions. We have already completed 10 of them. And in this video, we are going to solve the 11th question, that is 56th from the actual paper. This is based on the Doppler effect in sound. An ambulance traveling uh, at a speed of 20 meters per second. So let's call this as V. S, the speed of the source, emits a sound of frequency 540 hertz from its siren, so F will be 540. Sunanda is driving a car which approaches the ambulance from the opposite direction at a speed of 20 meters per second. So let us call this as the detector VD. The detector speed is also the same as that of the source speed. What will be the change in the detected frequency by Sunanda as she crosses the ambulance? Okay, now this is important. Crosses the ambulance. I'll tell you uh, what's the what's the matter here. Okay, it is given that the speed of sound in air is 340 meters per second. So that is V. Let's call it as V. 340 meters per second. Achha. Now note that initially, okay, initially, how is the situation? Initially, the situation is the ambulance, okay, ambulance is moving in this direction, okay, and the uh, and the driver or, or Sunanda, the observer, she is moving in this direction. So initially, both the source of the sound and the detector of the sound they are approaching each other. Okay, they are approaching each other. Okay, so Sunanda will detect an increased frequency. Correct, you know that. Now, uh, finally, finally, now the ambulance will still be continuing its journey in this direction, and Sunanda will be continuing her journey in this direction. So in this case, they both are receding. That is, they will be uh, they will be moving away from each other. So again, Sunanda will detect a different frequency than what it was. Okay, well, what is the actual frequency? And the actual frequency is 540 hertz. And we would like to calculate. We would like to calculate the change in the two frequencies which Sunanda will detect first while approaching the ambulance and second while receding the ambulance. That's what they have asked us to calculate. What will be the change in the detected frequency? Okay, so when she, she is approaching the ambulance, she is actually detecting a different frequency, a, a, a higher frequency, higher than uh, 540 hertz when she is approaching and when she is receding, then she will detect a lower frequency. Correct? And we need to calculate the difference between the two. So let us now recall the Doppler effect formula. Okay, what is the formula? F prime, that is the frequency which the detector is going to detect. It is given by F into. Okay, F into. V plus or minus VD upon V plus or minus V. S, where D is the detector uh, velocity or speed, S is the source velocity, V is the velocity of sound, and F is the original frequency. Now, let us first calculate the approach frequency. By that I mean the frequency detected by Sunanda when she was approaching the ambulance. So what will that be? Let us call it F1A approaching. Okay, original frequency, 540 hertz into speed of sound is 340 given so in the numerator it will be 340 in the denominator also it will be 240 uh, sorry 340 and it also turns out that the speeds of the ambulance that is the source and Sudanda that is the detector they both are same so 2020 now when they are approaching each other the detected frequency is greater than what it is actually Okay, so in this case, because both the observer and the source are moving, we must write a plus sign here and a negative sign here. Okay, this is the frequency of the approach. Now, 
what is the frequency when they recede we need to use the same formula okay so let us call it f prime r this will be 540 into this will be 340 this will be 20 this will be 340 this will be 20 but this time because they are moving away from each other the detected frequency detected by Shurunda will be lesser than 540 so clearly the fraction here must be less than 1 so it will be 340 minus 20 upon 340 plus 20 and what we want is the difference between f prime a and f prime r clearly f prime a is greater than f prime r so let us calculate the difference now f prime a minus f prime r so that will be 540 into bracket so this is 340 plus 20 so that will be 360 let us write 36 and in the denominator it will be 340 minus 20 so let us write it as 32 okay minus now here it will be 32 in the numerator and uh, 36 in the denominator or this will be 540 into uh, 9 by 8 minus 8 by 9 am I right yes okay so that is 540 divided by 8 into 9 into bracket 81 minus 64 okay so how much will that be so that will be 15 by 2 into 15 into 17 by 2 how much is that Two fifty-five by 2 okay so that will be 127.5 Hertz okay that is the detected frequency so we can see change 127.5 Hertz that is option A okay now you understand that it is not just enough to calculate the frequency detected by Sunanda when she was approaching the ambulance okay and if you subtract okay now let, let's say you don't uh, understand what she crosses the ambulance means okay so what you will do is you'll just calculate the initial frequency and you will subtract 540 from that okay and if you do that you'll get an answer which will obviously not be equal to 127.5 hertz why because when she crosses the ambulance the, the the change in the frequency that she is going to detect is the difference between what it was detected by her act initially and what she will detect finally so this has okay so this is not the difference between the two frequencies and 540 it is the difference between the two frequencies themselves okay initially and finally okay so that is question number 56 answer 127.5